Jermaine Laguan Jackson was born on December 11th, 1954, in Gary, Indiana, into a family that would become one of the most famous musical dynasties in history. As the fourth child of Catherine and Joseph Jackson, Jermaine was exposed to music from an early age. His father, Joseph, was a steel mill worker with dreams of musical success for his children. He recognized the talent in his sons and formed the Jackson brothers, which included Jermaine and his younger brothers, Jackie, Tito, and Marlon, with Michael joining shortly thereafter. Jermaine grew up in a strict household where discipline and hard work were paramount. Music was an escape and a way to bond with his siblings. Under Joseph's rigorous guidance, the Jackson children rehearsed tirelessly, perfecting their harmonies and dance routines. Jermaine, known for his rich, soulful voice and bass guitar skills, quickly became a central figure in the group's performances. In 1964, the group was renamed the Jackson Five, and their talent began to attract local attention. By 1968, they had caught the eye of Motown Records. Jermaine, who often took lead vocals alongside Michael, played a crucial role in the group's early success. Their debut single, I Want You Back, released in 1969, was a massive hit, reaching number one on the Billboard Hot 100. This success was followed by more chart toppers like ABC, The Love You Save, and I'll Be There, working with other celebrities. The Jackson 5's association with Motown Records opened doors to collaborations and interactions with many other celebrities. As a member of this groundbreaking group, Jermaine found himself in the company of legends such as Diana Ross, Smokey Robinson, and Stevie Wonder. Motown's environment was a breeding ground for talent, and Jermaine benefited from the mentorship and camaraderie of established artists. Jermaine's solo career began in 1972, while still performing with the Jackson 5. His debut solo album, Jermaine, featured the hit single Daddy's Home, which showcased his ability to stand out as an individual artist. Throughout his career, Jermaine collaborated with a diverse array of musicians. His duet with Whitney Houston on If You Say My Eyes Are Beautiful is a notable highlight, exemplifying his versatility and appeal. In the late 1970s, after the Jacksons left Motown for CBS Records, Jermaine chose to stay with Motown, causing a temporary rift with his brothers. This decision was influenced by his marriage to Hazel Gordy, the daughter of Motown founder Barry Gordy. Despite the familial and professional tensions, Jermaine continued to produce hits like Let's Get Serious, which was co-written by Stevie Wonder. Health issues and advocacy Jermaine Jackson has faced health challenges, including a diagnosis of lupus, an autoimmune disease that can cause severe complications. His health struggles have led him to become an advocate for lupus awareness, using his platform to educate others about the disease and support research efforts. Continuing Legacy and Fame Jermaine Jackson's fame is intertwined with that of his family, but he has carved out his own legacy through his solo work, collaborations, and advocacy. While the shadow of his brother Michael's unparalleled success often looms large, Jermaine's contributions to music and his perseverance in the face of adversity are noteworthy. His autobiography, You Are Not Alone, Michael Through a Brother's Eyes, published in 2011, offers an intimate look at his relationship with Michael and provides insight into the complexities of growing up in the public eye. The book was both a tribute to his late brother and a reflection on their shared experiences and individual journeys. Jermaine's influence extends beyond his musical achievements. He has appeared in various reality TV shows, including Celebrity Big Brother, which introduced him to a new generation of fans. His ongoing efforts in music production, as well as his participation in Jackson family reunions and tours, continue to keep his legacy alive. Personal struggles and affairs, Jermaine Jackson's life in the spotlight has been marked by both professional success and personal turbulence. One of the most notable aspects of his personal life has been his relationships and the scandals that have sometimes accompanied them. Jermaine married Hazel Gordy, the daughter of Motown founder Barry Gordy, in 1973. This union was seen as a powerful alliance between two influential families in the music industry. However, their marriage faced numerous challenges, particularly allegations of Jermaine's infidelity. These rumors strained their relationship, and despite their efforts to maintain their union, they divorced in 1988 after 14 years of marriage. Together, they had three children. Jermaine Jr., Jermaine's romantic Autumn, life continued to attract media attention. His relationship with Margaret Maldonado, with whom he had two children, Jeremy and Jardin, was marked by further public scrutiny. 
Although they never married, their partnership and the children they shared added to the complexities of Germaine's personal life. One of the most controversial aspects of Germaine's romantic history involves Alejandra Genevieve Oaziaza. Alejandra had previously been in a relationship with Germaine's younger brother, Randy Jackson, and had two children with him. Despite this, Germaine and Alejandra began a relationship, leading to their marriage in 1995. This relationship was heavily criticized and caused significant tension within the Jackson family. Germaine and Alejandra had two sons together, Jafar and Germa Jesti. They eventually divorced in 2004, adding another chapter to the tumultuous nature of Germaine's personal life. Financial struggles, Germaine Jackson's financial issues have been a recurring theme in his life, contributing to the public perception of his struggles outside of his musical career. Reports of financial difficulties and legal battles over unpaid child support have frequently surfaced. In 2011, it was reported that Germaine owed nearly $100,000 in unpaid child support to Alejandra for their two sons, Jafar and Your Majesty. These financial woes were further compounded by Germaine's lavish lifestyle and the costs associated with maintaining it. In 2012, Germaine faced another financial challenge when he filed a petition to change his last name to Jackson for artistic reasons. Many speculated that this was a move to reinvent himself and escape the financial burdens associated with the Jackson name. The court approved his request, but the name change did little to alleviate his financial struggles, health issues, and advocacy. Jermaine Jackson's health has also been a significant concern over the years. He was diagnosed with lupus, an autoimmune disease that can cause widespread inflammation and damage to various body systems. This condition has led to periods of ill health and has required Germain to manage his symptoms carefully. Despite these challenges, Germain has remained active in his career and personal life. His experience with lupus has also made Germain an advocate for awareness and research related to the disease. He has used his platform to educate others about lupus and to support organizations dedicated to finding a cure. His advocacy work is a testament to his resilience and commitment to making a positive impact beyond his musical achievements, professional struggles, and public scrutiny. Jermaine Jackson's professional life has been marked by both triumphs and setbacks. His decision to remain with Motown while his brothers left for CBS Records in the late 1970s caused a temporary rift within the Jackson family. This choice, influenced by his marriage to Hazel Gordy, led to a period of professional separation from his brothers. Although Jermaine continued to have a successful solo career with hits like Let's Get Serious, his relationship with his brothers was strained during this time. The competitive nature of the music industry and the constant comparison to his younger brother Michael Jackson also added pressure to Jermaine's career. While Michael's success was unparalleled, Jermaine worked hard to establish his own identity as an artist. This dynamic sometimes created tension, but it also motivated Jermaine to prove his own worth and talent. Public scrutiny has been a constant companion in Jermaine's life. His every move, from his romantic relationships to his financial troubles, has been documented and analyzed by the media. This intense public interest has often overshadowed his musical accomplishments and personal growth. Despite this, Jermaine has managed to maintain a sense of dignity and perseverance. Legacy and Resilience Jermaine Jackson's life is a testament to the resilience required to navigate the highs and lows of fame. His musical contributions, both as a member of the Jackson 5 and as a solo artist, have left an indelible mark on the music industry. His smooth vocals and charismatic stage presence continue to be celebrated by fans worldwide. Beyond his musical achievements, Jermaine's advocacy for lupus awareness and his commitment to social justice reflect his dedication to making a positive impact. He has faced numerous challenges, including health issues, financial struggles, and public scrutiny, but has consistently shown strength and determination. In recent years, Jermaine has continued to be involved in music production and has participated in Jackson family reunions and tours. His autobiography, You Are Not Alone, Michael Through a Brother's Eyes provides an intimate look at his relationship with Michael and offers insight into the complexities of growing up in the Jackson family.